This piece is called television. Go, stop telling lies to my vision. Stop telling lies to my vision. With those ultraviolet rays of television. That subliminal religion using precision to slice through the mind. Commercial lobotomies at every address. The free press, a million dollar organization owned by the government, creating its own covenant. Once the mind is controlled, the body will follow. Creating an illusionary tomorrow while workers are overwhelmed with sorrow. It seems the rich get riches, the poor will soon make negative income and succumb to the cruelty of reality, then come home to the tyrant that makes him a make-believe king, but the one who is deceived is the one who hosts the disease, the glowing box, more contagious than chicken pox, and a hundredfold more deadly, that grows into your family really causing all the tragedy, if only I had bulimic eyes to throw out the lies being fed into them, anorexic ears to vomit the unwanted ruckus, my senses have no justice, forced to accept the nuisance, repetitive sitcoms circle themselves to create nooses, but I grow older. Ironically, I hold the remote controller, but I'm under control. My soul on chains, big corporations controlling our brains, driving us insane but calling it normal. Madness becomes formal, but the TV addicts still stay loyal, ignoring the inner turmoil to watch others, actors pretend to be brothers and lovers, playing out love and other emotions. That rubs on the viewers like lotion and gets absorbed. It's George decapitating the greatest of minds that get bored. Become a slave to channel surfing with subliminal messages on different wavelengths that break sense to something uncommon. Speaking truths in the mouths of liars. Igniting mental forest fires that burn the trees of creativity to its roots. Desecrating the soils of knowledge to suit. TV the deadliest contraband. Turning lush metal Amazons into barren desert wastelands. Mm. Yeah.